Yeah. Welcome to What About Rob, everybody. Welcome to What About Rob. Subscribe to the Patreon. Uh, we have bonus episodes every week. Thank you all. We have we've been getting a ton of good feedback on the show. We are here at Grove Thirty Four. <laughs> I'm practicing my uh, professional intro. Can you can you tell? It's you really like it? good. You think that's good? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I didn't want to say anything about it at all. I, that's that. See, and I could tell by your silent reverence that it was mm-hmm. going really great. Uh, okay, <laughs> <laughs> follow us at What About Robbie Wolfgang, and with me is my trusty sidekick Wolfgang Hunter. Live from New York, it's a gun in my ass. And I never call you a sidekick, except that hat is giving sidekick. <laughs> it's giving sidekick. Ah, <laughs> uh, yes. I think it's actually giving beast mode, which is. Uh, my yeah, you're right. Nothing says beast mode like repeller at. <laughs> and uh, we have um, right. someone I've seen around. see if you can around. pull off a bold look, Robbie. I can. <laughs> That's why I'm praising, singing your praises. We uh, got to get you stitched up with I've a bowler hat or something. I've been hanging out with too many girls. Oh, man, I, you know, I'm, I I'm no good in hats. I, I actually almost wore a hat today because my hair is too long. Mm. Uh, but I'm like, I just can't hat. <laughs> I just can't do hats. Yeah. A ball cap, like a regular hat you can't uh, do? No, I have this Seinfeld hat I like. And I guess if I wasn't mm. going to wear it tonight, when am I ever going to wear it? It's, I'm just around my podcast friends. So. Right. Uh, Ethan Mead is here. Super yeah. funny comic, great, great roast battler. Thank you. And, wow, thanks uh, so much. We'll put yeah. it on your tombstone. Fantastic. Hey, That's exactly what I wanted he, out of this life. His favorite part about comedy, roast battles. And you guys live together? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Me and him have actually never lived together. No. I, you've, you've occupied my former place of residence and lived with Jonah for a month. You're so articulate. Thank you. That was incredible, yeah. I lived in the, um, the, the back room of a basement uh, that... You used to flop in and Quit the road used to flop Quit bragging. in. bragging. Yeah. No, no, not that Life's one. Going you lived with good. Jonah at my apartment. I never crashed at Oh, Brian's. that's yeah. right, that's right. I've lived in both yeah. you and Rowie's former, former residence. Well, Rowie, I wouldn't even call that a residence because he never had to pay anything. Rowie doesn't really live in the traditional sense. Yeah, he he's kind sort of, of just... it's kind of like a moss. Mm. Well, you see, when you're Jewish, uh, you just start renting out any apartment building you're in. <laughs> a Jewish man got very mad that they tried to build a, a yeah. wall in I, the... Uh, really? Yeah, yeah, yeah. So he built a tunnel? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Is that where they build the tunnels? He went under like a groundhog. Have you seen them do it in real time? They're fast as fuck. Yeah. They're the like t- moles. The tunnel, yeah. They're like, <laughs> like Roadrunner. They're like Diglett. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you just see a, a fissure in the concrete. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> They're like, Lechaim, Lechaim. <laughs> <laughs> They're earthbenders, dude. They're incredible. Jewish guy used. Uh, mm-hmm. Dig. <laughs> Dig is one. Uh, used invoice. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. He brew on who he brew on use false flag yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and twelve kindergartners were shot to death today. <laughs> oh God! Everyone's sympathy rose. J- Jewish guy used the media. It's super effective yeah. against your parents. Yeah. Ooh, hey, that's a think. fucking thinker. Hey, as Draymond Green said, this is the new media, folks. Podcast. <laughs> Sorry, <laughs> your Hebrew, your Hebrew on is no match for my Draymond Green. As a media type is canceled out by a Facebook Live type. <laughs> Draymond, use go live. <laughs> yeah, we live in this bitch. Right now. Yeah, I'm here with my Jews. <laughs> well, you know what's funny is, uh, sorry, uh, this is my stupid autism that I'm gonna get out of the way mm-hmm. really quickly. Mm-hmm. But Draymond today just went off on KD and uh, Nurkic, like just did a did like a full podcast. It was kind of like a Louis J. Gomez move where he's like, here's my po- here's my beef with these guys. <laughs> and uh, it really tickles me how he basically has a, a worse background than this one. Mm. Like, he's still just up against the white wall and just has <laughs> he's just shooting mic, from the hip in where his it's house. Like all, all these, he's on the biggest team in the NBA, or one of the biggest teams, and, like, uh, other yeah, players the on, like... The winningest team in modern history. Yeah, w- yeah. one of these, all these great sets, and Draymond still is, like... Like, how does Draymond Pissed. have a worse set than, like, fucking... <laughs> <laughs> like, every comic we know. <laughs> <laughs> That's awesome. What is he mad about, Katie? Because Katie's just annoying on Twitter. Uh, Katie, when he got suspended for punching the person, he's. I, I think Katie was like, "You really shouldn't be punching." So people. I'm, I'm with him. I'm with him on hating this guy Nurkic because I think that guy's a bitch. But the Katie thing, I think, is like a bad look. He's, he's the, the, the white boy who got learned. Yeah, he got. Yeah, yeah. he done. Yeah. Been they learned. taught his. They sat his white death. That is what is down. He needs to listen. They taught him a lesson. He taught him a lesson. Yeah. Well, I call Draymond Green the uh, Black Napoleon because he was exiled uh, for uh, <laughs> trying to mm-hmm. conquer Eastern Europeans, <laughs> and uh, now he's back, mm-hmm. and he's gonna win us. Uh, he's gonna conquer. He's gonna conquer. Brit, 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 New England. Very good. Napoleon tried to conquer original England. Original England, England and yes. New England is the Boston, Boston Celtics. Celtics. Very good. Woo! I did what it. about Rob? I did uh, it. NBA Finals. Get, right. Lock, autism, lock of the century. Autism, lock of the century. That's a lot. Maybe. That's the, it. On FanDuel.com, use promo code <laughs> use promo code retard. Uh, <laughs> 
is that Draymond awesome. Green Napoleon? I think yeah. it's a plus 1,000. I think that's the Robbie Good if, lock If of there the was ever a bet on FanDuel.com that was called the Retards Gambit, the retards. I would drop $500 no matter what it is. That's my favorite Netflix show. That's World Series Retards Gambit. That's what they call yeah. love on the spectrum. That's called yeah. getting my a house. four-year degree. <laughs> Just eating the opponent's pieces when they're not looking. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> uh, this checkmate, my friend. That's actually the people who think Ryan Reynolds is the best game. What you don't yeah. know <laughs> is that as a grandmaster, when you were looking around to hit the timer, I shoved <laughs> all of the chess pieces in my first game. In my own first game. In my, my own first game. That would be checkmate, my friend. My friend. <laughs> That's my favorite. And now if you look down again, you will notice the board is in my ass. <laughs> God, he's Wolfgang, a- everything you say is ten percent funnier with that fucking hat. <laughs> yeah, dude, it's like when you equip like uh, like a good piece of gear. Yeah, the, it's like Final Fantasy. You can't Fantasy, reskin yeah. it. You know, they uh-huh. haven't they haven't added the option in yet where you can just like do the make it disappear. Oh yeah, you <laughs> have to like you have to like gear. level up to like get rid of yeah. it. This is the Wolfgang alternate skin yeah. in Smash Brothers. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Little Wolfie. Is Ethan yeah. a little loud to you, Wolfgang? She could, Wolfgang. Or am I... Am I ter- oh, fucking I sorry. Driven? Sorry. It's not your fault. Mm. It's the fucking... On a, scale oh, of one to, on a scale of one to Draymond Green, I think he's maybe about... Um, Two. The starting well, lineup. On court or off court? Um, Both. On court, he's much louder. Oh, then he's always court. screaming at, like, refs. He's always yeah. like, what? <laughs> it's like, does that ever convince anyone when they're just yeah. screaming? Oh, at the you're ref? right. Has the ref ever like, you know what? <laughs> now that you yeah. put it that way... Yeah. <laughs> Are yeah, you, you like he's stupid? not even mic'd oh, up, but you can hear fault. you I can didn't... just hear the N word from like hey! yeah, 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 yeah. It's like from that far away. <laughs> the ref is like, oh, you know what? When I made that call, I didn't think a black guy would be screaming <laughs> in my face, but now you've won <laughs> me over. And he's like, well, it's up to anybody to figure out what he might have said. <laughs> we need to read. I'm, just, I'm so happy football's over because now it's all basketball, the and hockey. Yeah, some of us I'm not, have. I'm not white enough. Some for of hockey. us have dads who failed out of the police academy. Thank Hell you very yeah, much. Yeah. Some, Is hockey white? Some trash? of us aren't banned from every NHL game now. Are not ba- every NHL, not any NHL game. You want to talk about it? What yeah. Oh, you right. are you banned for, for that? I'm no, of course not. I think they, 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 What are they going to get me that, on? You hear that, Wolfgang? Is he, is he hot in your uh, in your headphones? Yeah, maybe a little bit. Can you talk, Ethan John Mead? Yeah, no, I, I think I think Ethan just has a he has a powerful vibrato. Okay, and yeah, maybe speaks from the diaphragm. Yeah. yeah, I'm holding it like right, right here, right, right, right cool. here. No, I think yeah. fans are gonna like that when they're listening to that going through the line at Chick Fil A. Now to delve into my trunk, <laughs> to, to my art. Don't fucking set a time bomb for what me. A mid sentence, you're no, making me okay. chuckle. I'll what take do you mean? <laughs> you yeah, I'll take the gun. Thanks a lot. Yeah, I'm Cowboy Jack Robinson. It's a character from my favorite TV show, Cowboy Jack Robinson. Cowboy Jackie Robinson. Yeah. Yeah, that's him. He was in the in the Wild West was the White Boys MLB. Really? Yeah, that's what I say. That's true. That's what I always say. Jackie yeah. Robinson was the original Cowboy. Oh yeah. Eighty years after the Cowboys. Yeah, yeah. 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 I don't think he likes being called boy though. So you might. Want oh, to cow, man. cow man. Yeah. But he oh. likes fucking cows. Hey yeah. folks. Hey. She was a beautiful. Oh man, I didn't know the magazine came out. <laughs> uh, that's what I said when Hustler got its new issue. They should do uh, in the police academy, like you know, when you adopt a dog and they just let you like acclimate with it for like fifteen minutes. Right. They should just mm-hmm. give you a gun and just let you do whatever for a little <laughs> bit. <laughs> just kind of get a feel for it. Be like, oh well. You know those. Yeah, like, you, should get a, oh. you should get a seven day free trial. <laughs> yeah. You know those like uh, screen printing commercials for like you can print any design on your shirt. It's just like you fiddling around with that uh. gun, and then there's a guy with like Skittles and an Arizona oh. iced tea. It's like. Make any T-shirt you want. Even put yourself on a T-shirt. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, so why did you get banned from the NHL? I didn't get banned from any NHL. So I've yet the NHL has yet to drop a ban. Uh-huh. Gary Betterman, I fucking dare you to try. Those are fine. Yeah. Um, we did it come through that I was calling you a cop? Yeah, no, okay, I clocked cool, it. Cool, yeah, cool, 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 cool. It would be so awesome if I could just tell my story. Dude, I, yeah, I'm sorry. I, <laughs> sort of I think that would really hit. I mean, it would just be cool if uh, much. I wanted to say that to Wolfgang. Like, <laughs> what, I wish they what I wish they would have done on 9-11, uh, uh, if you could land the plane, mm. maybe perhaps I wouldn't have the need to interrupt you. Oh, my Lord. I went to a, I went to a National Hockey League game. Mm-hmm. In Dal- I have my, my benefactress, uh, who's a dear friend of mine, is a big Dallas Stars fan. Oh, Megan Mitchell? Meg- <laughs> She'll be No. No. <laughs> Who? My high school had a, uh, a an unnamed foundress for a lot of years, so that's I'm very used to like a, an anonymous woman giving me money. Yeah, that's funny. pretty cool. Yeah. We had um, that's cool for just bring you to a game. That's awesome. It was very nice. Yeah, I've always wanted fucking glass yeah. seats, which were awesome, which yeah, I've never dude. been on in my life. She took me to the Devils the night before mm-hmm. on the glass, mm-hmm. fucking amazing. And then you got to bring your friend. She's like, Ethan, bring a friend. So I brought I brought two friends. You brought Noah, right? I brought two in. Damn, and how much money does she have? Andrew Muller. She's doing okay for herself. Oh, I like okay. how you brought Andrew and you cut him out of anything you posted about that day. <laughs> What did I post him? I didn't post shit. Well, whoever took the pictures, I did not even know he was there. The initial video, so we got, she bought resale seats on the glass. Mm-hmm. Um, 
and I, I don't know if it didn't say it on the website or if she didn't look, but they were wheelchair accessible. Yeah. So it's like a rubber. You, you literally come down like the VIP entrance towards like the players hallway. Uh-huh. Yeah. And you just come into like a rubber pasture that's right on the glass. Right. Um, and it's dawning on us because we were all like, oh, we'll be silly. Uh, Megan loves the fucking propeller hat. Yeah, it's funny. And like the big lollipop. It's so funny. Yeah, it's a cute little. It's you Yeah, know. she's 50s coded. Yeah, and we were going to do like. Exa- also, she just, is very 50s coded. It's just because she's but it's racist. Also just silly. It's silly. Yeah, the whole gimmick yeah. was it's our first hockey game. Right. So we brought the little boy propeller hats and we had a sign with like glitter and sequins and shit. Oh, so you, it it, like, the bit was like, it's our first hockey yeah, game? Yeah, and like, we're all grown men. That's hilarious. And one beautiful Twitter comedian. Uh, you obviously still have feelings for relax. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we might. We'll we'll put appreciate that there. Appreciate you know, that, the, guys. She's got to listen to this. You said beautiful. I was she just, is beautiful. I don't know. I don't know you guys' relationship at all. I was just saying, from the way you said beautiful. I, um, I read we're beautiful. just going off the way that you and her look well, at I just each say other th- when your eyes meet. Yeah, three grown men and dude. If there was any spark in the other end of her direction, you know I'd be fucking torturing <laughs> myself. Aww. I would be dragging myself through pins yeah. and needles. Aww. Yeah. But the point is, <laughs> people got really mad on Twitter because they were like, oh, you're wearing propeller hats. Megan posted a video fairly retardedly. She was like, oh, the people are going to want to see this. No, but they did. The most incriminating video. It was really video. funny. It's a really funny video. Most, it's really funny. Most people appreciate that. It's just there's a very vocal appreciate minority that. that. It's just an enormous misunderstanding. But people who are going to get mad are obviously going to be louder. But the video said, yeah, as, a guys, ca- you don't as a caption, guys, it said. Um, my friends are retarded. Yeah. Mm-hmm. <laughs> yeah. But we said, she said, we do not know beforehand. Our idea was this was going to be our first game, and then somebody like put the curb music over, it, and it's like, yeah, this. But, just but the, looks but the joke bad. is that you had propeller hats and giant lollipops in like the handicaps. Section. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. And we were like, this looks awful. It's the optics are so funny. But it's like such a caricature of what like. Is that what you're trying to do? Yeah. You fucking two bit head. No, no. I was but doing part of what was funny was that. Sunny. Oh. But what what yeah. part of the joke was that you similar. didn't know that it was exactly yeah. yeah that's and we're like oh this looks if you awful. Guys, if you guys if the joke was hey we're gonna dress up like retards and go to the wheelchair, <laughs> <section, laughs> I'd be like a that's a shitty that's a terrible yeah. bit. You would love that. I would love if that. we did that. <laughs> I, I I hate it because you stole my bit. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I got a great idea. I I, I think people um, yeah. Guy, what's the follow-up video for Meg? Like, guys, we went to the being Asian convention on an accident with our eyes taken. <laughs> we went to the Raiders game, what but it turned out to be an NAACP. Oh meeting. my God, we had no idea. <laughs> <laughs> we came with our taped uh, eyes and calculators, and the Asian people got mad at us. We had no idea what the, the joke is. We were looking doing. really hard at our equation. Yeah, we've huh? been staring in the sun for an hour to try to gain true and ultimate knowledge. We were, we were wearing our Buddhist symbols, but it turned out we turned them slightly to the right, and they looked no, like swastika. No. Like that. no. <laughs> yeah. So they got us. They were not. Nobody really. People don't want to see nuance. Apparently, people don't like no. new age media. Mm-mm. Mm-mm. No. So well, it's so funny. From... It's funny that the whole caption is like, "We didn't know this would happen," and, and the joke is that it's a very funny coincidence. Yeah. People are like, we "You get did it so know much... it would happen." <laughs> you did know. We didn't know it would but happen. Even if we're you afraid we get in trouble. You did know, and you are in trouble. Well, it's funny because it's not like the retards even, are getting like, mad at you. It's so over the no. top <laughs> that even if you did know, it's still funny. But there and there are none. Yeah, no one is a retard. No one is a retard. I'm kidding. Yeah, except for everybody at NHL. It's game. it was so good that yeah. everyone who <laughs> getting mad at right. us saw the exact same association that we saw. Yeah, it was like, oh, this is gonna look bad, and they were all like, well, that's because if you ask somebody, well, why do wh- what's wrong with wearing a propeller hat in that section? It's like, well, you look retarded, right? <laughs> and we're like, what are you fucking talking? So, you uh, can yeah. play dumb until right. the cows come home. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Mm-hmm. yeah no, it's. Uh... I'm a genius. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Well, you just thought out your defense pretty well. I mean, it's. It makes sense. Wait, was it all on TikTok, the blowback, or was it on Twitter? 90, I would say 90% of it was on TikTok. I think yeah. TikTok blowback is always the dumbest blowback, and yeah. it also gets like the it least traction. It goes away the quickest, yeah. too. Megan TikTok is, is also, very disposable, because most people don't see most of the posts. It's just funny. Megan's also like a um, like an aristocrat on TikTok. It's kind of hard. Really? Her her like um, her persona. Know, her cast below her is pretty defensive. Oh. So that anytime somebody was like, excuse me, I'm a I'm a gymnast with invisible disabilities and you upset me. I have fibromyalgia, <laughs> yeah. which sounds like a breakfast cereal for fat women. Mm. Yeah. <laughs> Hi, my name is fibromyalgia. Fib- <laughs> fibromyalgia. Be people, fibromyalgia. Fibromyalgia. Get your ass so, back in the damn house. Fibromyalgia. <laughs> Leaving that door, going in and out that door. Decide where you're going. You in or you out? <laughs> 
This Stop leaving that door flying Ooh, that's open. number 32. Fibromyalgia. He's first out of Michigan State. <laughs> that's exactly. <laughs> <laughs> oh, up next on an all-new Fibro. monk. We got an all-new monk. Fi apostrophe yeah. bro myalgia. Yeah. <laughs> Fibromyalgia. Now, in, th in three years, he's going to be something special, that fibromyalgia. Yeah, in high school, they taught me about the fibromyalgia of the cell, but not how to do taxes. Mm -hmm. That's heckin' stupid. That's heckin' stupid. I'm loving this, Wolfgang. Thanks, man. Yeah. I'm loving Facebook, Wolfgang. I saw I got... Yeah, you can have the one. Okay. Uh, the guy who was doing spontaneous poems in um, mm -hmm. the Washington Square Park. I'm like, that's a first round draft pick. Yeah. Spontaneous oh, yeah. poems. Oh, yeah. yeah I mean, LSU. <laughs> <laughs> that one got me really bad. <laughs> uh, my name is Spontaneous Poems. Spontaneous Poems. <laughs> <laughs> my my name is Jameis Pontilius. Yeah. Okay. That's spontaneous. Po you know, he's sneaky athletic. Yeah. Uh, he's really athletic. <laughs> sneaky athletic. That, that's what, Actually, that, that's what they say about white people, right? Sneaky athletic. Sneaky athletic. Yeah. I just did a, a little sketch do about yeah, that's that. That's how they uh, yeah, describe Kish Christian McCaffrey. Hard nose. Uh, grit. Uh, grit. Lunch pail. Grit. Yeah, lunch pail. First in the locker room, last yeah. to leave. High, that's a high, high IQ, IQ football move. Yeah, yeah. I love yeah. high IQ. I love the way he ran through a guy. Yeah. yeah. Classy. <laughs> he plays a classy game of classy. basketball. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. He just takes all the other players on the team and makes them look out at the lake while he holds a revolver <laughs> to their head. He plays the game the right way. Yeah. Yeah. The way the, how they were supposed to play. Yeah. Larry Bird. I do have an exciting announcement Gritty. for the podcast. Chris Mullen. Ooh. Chris yeah. Mullen, Chris Mullen, yeah. oh, this is a very high school graduate. Bay Ridge. Oh, really? Yeah. Whoa. Yeah, that's only our did, that's our guy. Only did two years on the Warriors, but he was great. The odds of that happening, that's pretty. Oh, yeah, yeah, it's pretty good. He's yeah, he didn't, become a, he didn't become a cop. Yeah, right. under Larry Bird, I that's think. Right. Two high IQ guys. <laughs> 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 uh, that team made Mensa. They did not sniff the. Yeah, they, the didn't, realize, yeah. they didn't realize. Didn't yeah. realize. Was that the Jordan year? Uh, the he was. He was. Yeah, he played with Jordan. No, wait. He played with Jordan at some point. Yeah, it was on the Pacers. I'm pretty sure. He played with Jordan. On, he didn't play with Jordan on the Pacers. Pacers. There was a Bulls Pacers did. final. I, I don't know. If uh, Chris he played was against. The, I mean, he played. That's against, what I was talking. I about. just listened to him. On I a know podcast. four things about basketball. I just listened to him on a podcast. Yeah. So that's why I know all this stuff about Chris Mullen. We're gonna get you into sports one day, Wolf. It's gonna be great. Oh, I'm actually the biggest sports fan. Oh, <laughs> oh yeah. Hey, I'm Wolf Morrell. I would have. Uh, I'm the, the Knicks sponsor. Uh, uh, if I'm you want to get into sports, you're gonna have to learn the uh, hard way. People the say hard, hard. Hard. that was good. You have to learn the hard way. People yeah. say, uh, <laughs> a lot of people say I'm the unofficial uh, basketball player. Mascot if you want to learn about Knicks. Chris Mullen, you're going to have to learn the hard way. <laughs> <laughs> every, every player. This podcast has become for nobody, hard but way. really myself. <laughs> You know what every uh, you know what every basketball That's team. Funny. Who doesn't like uh, references to Sam yeah, Morrill Sam talking Rale. about 1991 Warriors team? <laughs> so this, well, what a lot of people don't say in basketball is the thing you need the most is uh, uh being yeah. a really good white. Uh. A really yeah. good white. Really good white. <laughs> Basically, really good white. Basically, you gotta be strong. Basically, you gotta be yeah. strong. Hey, Kevin hey, yeah. hey, Garnett, you wanna? Like, you can't just be strong. Kevin you Garnett, you be strong. <laughs> hey, Kevin Garnett, you wanna get together at, like noon tomorrow and uh, bounce ideas off each other? <laughs> I bounce ideas like you bounce basketballs. Yeah. <laughs> Yo, that's some shit he would say too. People loved our Sam. It got like two thousand views. The racist Sam Moral impression. Oh yeah, people like that. Yeah. Bo yeah. Boy. Yeah. Uh, He's pretty much yeah, just down uh, I play. Uh, I play full court. <laughs> yeah, it's uh, full court. <laughs> yeah. I got, oh, good fundamentals is a great white good guy. Good fundamentals. Yeah. That's that's the ultimate. That's just fundamentally that's sound just, basketball yeah. right there. What happened? To I can assists, I can dunk off. Huh? Of yeah. Uh huh. Yeah. yeah, yeah, it's about soccer passing. assists count a hell of a lot. Yeah, yeah, <laughs> yeah. White guys love assists and passing. Yes, sir. And like you know, ball motion. Yeah, yep. we just uh, like to see people reach yeah. their full potential. Yeah, just saying you <laughs> help a boy the way. <laughs> we Give like to assist. see us whites like to see yeah. people reach their Everyone full potential. Everyone gets a toy. Everyone gets a toy. I'm sort of uh, like Kevin Costner in every movie in the nineties. I just rewatched Uncut Gems. You guys seen that one? Yeah, yeah, what a picture. It's fucking great. It's what better every time, I think, because I'm not having a panic <laughs> attack after I know what's going to happen. Yeah, yeah, that's a real fucking, my chest is heavy. Yeah. Well, now that I know what's going to happen, I know he's, also, the Jolly yeah, Ranchers like, are picking up, and oh, people are going to sure. really hate those. Um, sorry, sorry. Fucking you know what they're going to love, though? What? Exciting announcement for the pod. I know I like mm -hmm. to hog the gun a lot. Mm -hmm. It just feels like, you know, I'm always leaving you out, so I'm introducing a new character what? to the show. It's, mm -hmm. uh... It's called the Robbie Gun. Yay! <laughs> yeah, that's for you, pal. Oh, wow. Fucking lucky. Shaped it after your penis. What? No. <laughs> oh, yeah. Uno reverse card, bitch. No, it's yeah. actually a very. <laughs> um, it's a strong, sleek gun, Robbie. And if you actually valued the power and femininity, uh, and weren't a sexist pig, you would. Dude, his gun that. is better than your gun. Yeah, dude. It's his a gun girl boss, dude. His gun actually Stop, has the, in the most name power. Of fabulousness. Stop. Yeah. It's sleek. It's. Form fitting and it fits in any purse. It's a more practical 
design, it jams less than the tech It's the type of gun you can fit in your pussy. And in your foreskin too, if you see it's it. It's the real vats in a size gun. Not it all women have <laughs> vaginas. You need to understand this. It would Hi, it's me, Girl Boss Herzog. <laughs> Herschel? No, Girl Verna Boss. Werner Herzog? Girl Boss Herzog. Good boss, It'd it. be funny to kill yourself with a tiny pink gun. <laughs> like, I'm going to end it all. <laughs> oh. I ate my fucking gun again. God damn it. You can't do anything right. Doc. <laughs> you ate the gun. Doc, I guess I'll just, again. Yeah, Doc, I ate the gun I again. I ate the gun. You got to stop buying tiny pink guns, but I they're ate so the gun. fun. But they're silly. <laughs> that is it's a like silly a, way to kill there's yourself. There's just a big gun indent on your belly, and you're like, why did you do this? Uh, Simon's like, I don't know. Doc, I, I actually know. bought the gun that, that has you the flag that comes out that says bang again. <laughs> <laughs> I bought the Joker 1990s Batman yeah. animated Fuck. series gun. Bang. I've always thought that was really funny. If the Joker did the bang gun to you, but it went in your throat and you threw up. Yeah. And he goes, oh, jeez. That's pretty oh, good Joker. Oh, God, Batman. That's a good Hamill Joker. <laughs> <laughs> oh, God. What the Batman, fu- what if I... Uh, shot Bad my gun land. and an Israeli flag came out the back of it. <laughs> Joker. No, Joker. I'm begging you not to do that. Joker. I'm a Zionist, Batman. Jews you know, need a homeland. I think the Riddler would love that. There's well, a lot going uh, on there. Riddle me this, Bats. He's just joking. There's me, two million Palestinians no one has living in Gaza City. Yes. What are we going to hmm. do with them? Oh, Joker. No, Joker. Nice. Well, it, jo- like Joni Mitchell, we're going to put up paradise and then make it a parking lot, <laughs> Batman. We're going to make Gaza a parking lot. <laughs> really just like this? Joni Mitchell ordained. Really You're this, Batman. If Hamas is, is reporting the death tolls, how many people actually died? <laughs> <laughs> I don't, I don't. I don't like you, Zionist. I'm watching Riddler. the Super Bowl. <laughs> <laughs> You're making me think about things that go against I, my I, own I, emotional. I that, that make me go. Well, These don't seem like riddles. You have two options. You can go save those Palestinian kids, mm-hmm. or you can go watch the Super Bowl. This was. I'm gonna watch the Super Bowl. This is really easy for even me, Batman. <laughs> oh, damn it. This, Quite frankly, the situation is even too complicated even for me. I'm mostly, <laughs> I'm mostly used to like rescuing people from the Statue of Liberty. <laughs> also, also, Wayne Tech has a significant yeah. amount of investment in the w- yeah. Defense Department. This, this seems like a decades-long <laughs> blood feud that's tied to religion. And I think <laughs> people are op- oversimplifying the entire situation. Personally, I have an old-school Republican take on it. I just hope they blow each other up. <laughs> yeah. I'm, a, I'm a devout Catholic, so I really have no, I have no dog in this fight. <laughs> I pray for both of you. This is uh, this conflict is actually pivotal for our apocalyptic mm. prophecies. If that Ooh, that's a good yeah. one. That's yeah. a good. That's a good huh. D tier take. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Thanks, man. Huh. I've been. I've we been gotta listen- expand the center. I've been listening to the guys on the bus a lot lately. I've been mm-hmm. trying to, you know, they. I've si- I've sat my white ass down in the open seat <laughs> for an old lady. I took. I sat my white ass down in that handicapped seat and I listened. Mm-hmm. Guys, can can I be real for you guys for a second? I think it's really important Robbie, for all please. of us to sit our white asses down. That's something. Facts. I, thank yeah. You, thank you. After a hard day's work. Because mm-hmm. mm-hmm. it's like at our computer look, jobs. We spend all day talking our damn privileged. Yeah. Yep. Privileged white mouths. Our beautifully. Off. Braced it, straight teeth, privileged mouth, straight mouth. white teeth, thin lipped. So we need to sit ourselves down and listen, and listen to black people. No, dude, John Stewart's back. I think we can't deny the it's, greatness. They're white dude, people. Anymore. I do. I know. <laughs> yeah. they, they Sorry. tried. They tried every woman Sorry. and black comedian in there. Like, get the old Sorry. Jews back. You couldn't follow Gosh. great. Do you remember the old you Red Fox? You couldn't follow greatness. Do you remember the old Red Fox? This is like a total uh, on a very. They lo- got close with Roy Wood Jr., but then they wouldn't. Yeah, but it was. But like, I, here's my thing about all the Daily Show ripoffs. John Stewart was the only one who was probably good at it, besides Colbert and character. Yeah, like everyone else was serviceable. Like even you know even the other whites. So <laughs> yeah, <laughs> not Jordan Klepper. I want to shoot him with a gun because I like hate that format now. But then and when Michael I saw John, Cost, but when I saw John like Stewart again, too. when I saw John Stewart do it again, I was like, oh, I, I yeah. forgot that this is funny. I like this. I th- I think that's a very yeah. easy mistake to make. Oh, oh people like news comedy. No, right. people like yeah. John people Stewart. People like John Stewart, and he's like, it's a thing. It's like, yeah, and he yeah, loves nine like, eleven. It was you the see f- him on the TV, and you're like, well, oh my god, it's 2015 again. Well, he called out of work. That is the best console imaginable. My grandparents are still alive. It's 2015 all over again. Yeah. Wow. Life yeah, dude, Stephen Clay had a great game last night. John Stewart's back. It's 2015, baby. Usher was on TV. Yeah. Dude, he Fucking makes me laugh at like Harvard jokes. Like he makes John me laugh Stewart? at smart people jokes. Yeah. Yeah. He was like everything, whatever. He made that fucking heart speak. Did you see the little clip of him? Oh, that's the whole thing. I, I, I love yeah, John yeah. Stewart. Yeah, yeah. I've only seen that one snippet where he's I'm really like, happy that it was it was good. I'm like, yeah, very, yes. very, very, that could have been terrible. He really never lost a yeah, step. But I was, like, yeah, was he like, never lost his step. The problem is that we lost our step as a country. Yeah, yerp. And that's Yerp-erp. why we got fucking. I actually think he's smart. Just got guys living out in the comments, being like, "Not my John Stewart. He, I won't stand for this if he makes fun of Biden." Mm-hmm. Oh yeah, Keith Olbermann was like, "You could have arrested another nine years." It's like, 
No. How about, God, oh, how about you keep resting, buddy? Why don't you yeah. throw one over the plate at 98 miles an hour? Oh, wait, you can't because your arm's blown out and it's yeah. gay. How about you die? Yeah. <laughs> Keith Olbermann. He sucks. <laughs> how about you put a gun in your mouth and just die? How about you be a little more like Toby Keith Olbermann? Yeah. Uh-huh. Uh huh. Yeah. Uh. What the fuck were we talking about? Oh yeah. So John. Sir, Tol- yeah. I feel like he just picked up right where he left off, and it was like. Yep. It was like he. And it's like <sighs> I was like, oh, I forgot that I enjoy this format of comedy mm-hmm. until he did it. Again. And there's just a very select few. I'm hoping it's not just a nostalgia thing because maybe it was just a one up. But I'm like, I really do think it's like, oh, this is just one of those things where the performer and the format just fit each other like a glove. Yeah. And neither thing were as good without it. Well, also to but do now that, that back, to do that vocation and be that like figure that john stewart is you can't be up your own ass yeah which he's good at not doing yeah all the other people were very much up their own asses i think it was actually a really smart and subversive move to go hard at biden in his first episode nice yeah yeah i gotta watch it. i'm gonna watch it. the whole segment is just him like being like biden's old what the fuck are we doing <laughs> that's like, that's like the whole, i'm like he's like trump's old too but it's like if people he paid a little lip service to that but it was it was a very hard segment on biden i yeah. would say do you believe um, it was scathing that yeah. that uh who, who, that Whatever the high council, who is like, yeah, Joe Biden is um, is cotton candy between his ears. Uh, what's Somebody the, said that, heard he, about that. that he forgot like when the years from which he was vice president. Oh, uh, oh, the you mean the, oh, the special died. council? Yeah, yeah the, the high council. council. I was like, what is this? The Masons? The <laughs> yeah, he's meeting with El- <laughs> the knights. Oh, no. <laughs> the fucking knights of Columbus. Folks, we got uh, the one ring <laughs> of Sauron. Yeah. What are we gonna do with it? I think we're that gonna run it back I, I, the fire. I kind of think that, folks. I mean, I kind of think that was a partisan Folks, hack, I got stuck in an enormous piece of bit. taffy. But I also think Joe Biden's probably... Like, Folks, they put me in a maze with cheese do instead not. of it. I really want that cheese. <laughs> How do I find the cheese? Do not go to Willy Wonka's factory. I got stuck in a it, life-size piece of bubble gum. It's funny because like, it was like when Democrats were investing... Why it, is he Mitch Hedberg now? I'm, I got stuck Folks, in a life-size do not go piece of bubble gum. A bubble gum. Uh, but I like Sorry. when the Democrats investigate Trump. We're like, we're gonna we're gonna be fair and and get a Republican <laughs> special counsel. Mm-hmm. And then when the Republicans investigate Biden, we're like, we're also gonna be having a Republican special counsel. <laughs> yeah. It's like they do yeah. not fair. give a fuck. I mean, the guys. Oh like, yeah, yeah, no, that's a total girlfriend move. It's like, yeah, I'm gonna go out with my friends. Like, well, I'm actually gonna go out with my friends tonight. It's like, no, all your friends hate you. Shut up. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> bang, bang, bang. <laughs> Wolfgang's girlfriend no. and him are very... This is Wolfgang's girlfriend's name. That was name. me doing a character. Ladies and gentlemen, well. Wolfgang's girlfriend's name will Wolfgang's. be revealed at the end of this podcast. Wolfgang's girlfriend. Stay tuned for these important messages. Stay tuned. Do we have sponsors Wolfgang's yet? Wolfgang's girlfriend, everybody. Ladies and gentlemen, <laughs> Wolfgang's girlfriend. Wolfgang's girlfriend? <laughs> We have a file wow, on her. We're only 20 minutes in. This is probably an exhausting hell episode. Hell yeah. <laughs> hell yeah. I'm having a good hell time. Yeah, hell yeah. Hell yeah. We got guns. I we could have Wolfgang's girlfriend in a summer haze if I wanted to. I could to. have you yeah. if I wanted to, and you would be on your knees for me. Your fucking wish, My dude. guns. Mine's bigger, bitch. Mine's pinker. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. And that's why it'll lose. No, we gave women a chance, and they couldn't okay, fucking so step up freaking, to the plate. Yeah. You guys like Kirby? I do. I, I actually love Kirby. Yeah. And in Kirby's... Fucking true form. I'll eat your gun and gain its powers. And Kirby's true. And then I'll be gunman. Kirby's goaded. Kirby's actually epic. Mm-hmm. <laughs> <laughs> we spent is he low key goaded with yeah. the sauce? Okay. Yeah, just adjectives for Kirby. Yeah. yeah. Kobe is freaking sweet. Kobe's actually awesome. She's so cool. Kirby yeah. versus Kobe. Kobe's actually goaded yeah, with so the sauce. This would be if I had a podcast. It would be me saying, you know, it'd be awesome if Kirby and Kobe had a rap battle. Kirby and Kobe. That'd be awesome. Right. And Sam Morell announces like Kobe and Kobe. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> Kobe and Kobe don't want to so run. So yeah. I'm Kobe. over a Kobe you enthusiasm. So basically, yeah. <laughs> Kobe you enthusiasm. I like that a lot. Dude, Mad from Cartoon Network would love that shit. Yeah. The Mad animated series. I want Sam Morell to see all this. You know, I want him I want him to see he himself probably would not as like the it, world. I feel like. Yeah, yeah, I want Sam Morell to know I've watched very little of his stand-up. He's yeah. a very funny and a good comic, and I hope he takes me on the road. And I was into <laughs> I was also into joke. Okay, movie. asshole, me too. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> no, I said it first. I no, I want no, Martin. I called dibs. I, I, I called dibs. More. I want Mark. You don't to need take it. I need road. it. <laughs> I need it so much. I don't more. even. Have I been in the shot at all? <laughs> Who cares? I think so. Okay, I just want him to see the propeller hat because it's like. I think you're in the shot. Okay, good. Cares if I uh. <laughs> That's how much I actually care about being in the shot. I, I was just trying to talk about take the shot. Take the shot. I want to show my alt comic heroes Kirby and be like, do you like this? <laughs> Is this cool to you? What's I liked on? Kirby. Your Connor enthusiasm. O'Malley, please watch my Kirby, exactly. your enthusiasm yeah, bit. <sighs> Joe Perry be like, why are you showing me this? <laughs> wow, that's yeah. 
It's kind of cool. He's a circle, but he's also hey, pink. It's, kind of a circle. it's me, Michael Shannon. I heard Joe Perry. Was there. <laughs> I'm actually a really big fan of Joe Perry. Yeah. Hey, you know, it's me, Jack Nicholson, and I'm yeah. here too. And I'm also yeah. Jack Nicholson. Hey, it's us two Jack Nicholsons. Well, what are the odds, folks? Two guys <laughs> pretending to be me, but guess what? My gun's bigger. And then a third guy comes in. And then I'm also the. What spider. are you doing, girl? Matt, there's already three of us. Okay, girl dinner. It's. <laughs> It's a, bullet. It's, a, it's a bullet. It's a bullet in your mouth. What if it was the girl? girl what, there it is. What if it yeah. was the girl Joker and he was like, "Would you still love me if I was so, so serious?" A lot of. <laughs> Shut, up. <laughs> Shut up. I'm just a this mad can't be how it dog ends. chasing cars. <laughs> I actually hope that I die very shortly after someone says something like that. What? And those are the last words I hear. What if, if, oh, you what, think what if I was so serious? Right, and, what then if, I, I and then my heart steps beating. You think oh, yeah. those old comics know. will love you forever, Ethan? You're more like me than them. No, They're going to look up where you went to college. And mm-hmm. <laughs> that would suck. <laughs> And the world Don't will look turn it on up. you in a second. Don't look it up, please. All because you tried to be guy funny to a girl. <laughs> ten, ten alt comics post all women lineups. No one bats no an one eye. Bats. One alt male lineup and everyone loses their minds. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Joker. Yeah, uh, Joker. <laughs> There's not even a diversity quote anymore, Batman. <laughs> Most shows only have one white guy on. <laughs> you have two options ahead of you, Batman. And here's You're the best one. Why you can, do we even need diversity shows if all shows are diverse? Hmm? You can keep... Sh- Joker, it's about equity. It's not about equality. equality. <laughs> if you increase diversity, Sound? you increase the originality of thought. Sounds like you move the goalposts. <laughs> <laughs> Joker, are you implying I'm the Joker, that if you make everybody way. diverse, <laughs> it'll somehow still thoughts, create shit. dogmatic in a dogmatic environment in which everybody is different but has the same opinions on subject matter? <laughs> it's a bunch of people of different races. Because that would be problematic and racist, Joker. Lily Singh is an icon. Dude, Lily Singh is doing right. the all-star game. Is in the celebrity game. What is she, the fucking Thank ball? Fuck. Getting tossed around by those guys? Oh! <laughs> Hey, that's my people, technically. See no. you in hell. See you in hell, bitch. Oh, great, your worst nightmare. Great show, though. I loved your show, Lily. <laughs> yeah, it was really good. <laughs> well, Batman, you can either condemn Shane Gillis and keep him from hosting SNL, or you can watch Lily sing do an hour. <laughs> Batman, the you choice, can is the choice is yours. Book the man you scorned and make one million dollars. Or let Io Edabiri have a second victory. <laughs> My father hosted at Pine Box Rock Shop. <laughs> <laughs> that's, the, that's the thing, Batman. It's me, non-binary face. Yeah. You either live long enough, you either die a great comic, or you live long enough to see yourself become a girl comic. <laughs> yeah. Was that worth me stuttering, you think? I oh, guess, good. yeah. And I'm Bane. Yeah. I just I'm well, no. Bane. It's me non-binary. It's me no, no. <laughs> I, you know I'm I, really I, just trying to do the road. I don't think we need to establish uh, what Bane's take on girl pro- comedy is. My pronouns were born darkness. I'm just normal Bane. <laughs> no. I'm just trying no, to blow I think, up Gotham. I think that you're doing non-binary. What? No. And Ethan, take the floor. What's wrong this the floor is yours. I'm actually just trying to liberate Gotham. I'm not <laughs> sure how this got. Why is it the so hard to move? politics issue. It's so hard I'm to move tickets as a non-binary You merely adopted testosterone. All right. I was Let born me. with it and thought it didn't really fit. <laughs> I went bald at 17. It's non-binary talking to trans <laughs> face. It tra- <laughs> trans face. Trans face. <laughs> two trans, two face, and then one's a woman and one's a man. Ben, are, are, you saying, are you saying I'm not passing? You're passing gas, bitch. <laughs> Stop farting. Well, it looks like we're going to have a doll flip a- from Chowder. <laughs> Chowder! <laughs> Folks, write in and let Pussy. us know if this episode is listenable. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we might have to cut this part. That's what you get when you get the Cobra King in the, in this, I know. In the hot seat. We're just all excited and no, fun. We need, a, we need a sous chef. We have too many head chefs Ooh, in the I kitchen. Want sushi. You're so stupid. Mm-hmm. That made me angry. Dude, my therapist, therapist alert, was mm-hmm. like, maybe don't drink for a couple days. Shut up, bitch. Is shut, where up, shut up, yeah. bitch. Shut up, Stephanie. You're a good woman. Sorry, yo, pause. Did pause. you submit that you go to therapy? Yeah, I'm sorry. Nah, 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 nah. Chill with that, man. You're going to have to hold that Dude, gun Dude, what's now. fucked up is I go you're to gonna therapy. You're going to have to hold the sissy gun now. Oh, put it in your, put it, put it mm-hmm. against your clit. 
Put it against your clit. My real clit? Your real clit. Okay. Because you don't have a penis no more because you a girl. You, you a, a female girl. now. You're a girl. You're a girl. Mm-hmm. Sounds like a girl response I love, just now. I, I, <laughs> it's, it's, <laughs> the thing I just said back at you, but with more emphasis and Dude. zeal. Emerson went really hard to try and make me um, a, a girl. You went to Emerson? For two years, yeah. I, I went to Emerson. You went to Emerson? Yeah. yeah. Did we but ever want about that? What? I, I left in disgrace. Mm-hmm. Oh, I know, I know. Unfortunately, uh, you know? No, higher no, education was no match for your Twitter presence. Wait, what? Ha- why did you have to leave Emerson? What happened? Uh, why did I? I didn't have to leave. Why, did, it, why I, does I, any... I chose, why did you, I, fun fact, at least a little asterisk. I left. You can't fire me. I quit move. Why did you uh, resign in disgrace? Um, <laughs> people got girl mad at him. People did get girl mad why? at him. Why? Uh, I was on the set of a production, and I was the audio person, and I had to like fix somebody's battery pack, mm-hmm. and the girl was like, it's on my bra, and I was like, well, sweetheart, you got to move that dress out of the way, oh. <laughs> and I got fucking killed. Really? Dude. Yeah, they, he, I, I told you, you tried to be guy funny to a girl. Yeah. Oh, no. I, uh, yeah, I paid the price heavy for that one. I think I, I barely missed when Emerson got like insanely gay. I heard that it, it was coming in hot. I think. Yeah. It was maybe the year right or as two. I was leaving, yeah, I would say. I so I got like banned from production. Someone's like, "Hey, you made someone really upset," and I was like, "That's crazy." We've I got also, banned from productions, uh, and we've then also people banned didn't you know. from the mess hall. They did ban me from the mess hall. I starved. That's you why were, I'm banned, so... were you really banned from the? No, I was hall? not banned from the mess. Wait, hall. but you can do it. What, were you, what was your major? Uh, visual media arts, and I was my banned man, from the. That, yeah, yeah. It was banned from the non-binary plus size for, for a semester. I was banned from the TV station, and I was like, "Well, I'm not going back to these people who think I'm a fucking." And that's the thing; they didn't like say. No one knew why I wasn't. I was banned. Right. You just yeah. Like, yeah. Ethan Mead. I'm pretty sure bashed the girl's head in right. with a rock and then fucked her mom. Yeah. That's. Yeah. Oh yeah. no, they really play a game of telephone with. Uh, it's your, pretty cool. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, I mean, you're a bad guy. It's pretty cool. But here's I think, the thing: I think is, is you I'm were fucking pro- coming. You dude. were probably in the eye of the storm of that because it might be better now. But I don't know. Maybe it just got. The eye of the storm is actually the same. My part. favorite thing yeah. to do. With I was in the storm. <laughs> yeah. Huh? Oh, I said my favorite thing to do with a game of telephone is to be the last guy and be like. A second plane is just at the. Twin <laughs> <laughs> a second that's propeller hat guy is just at the twin towers. Wow! I, oh, that's the uh, actually no, I didn't. No, he didn't do that. So that's pretty cool. Mm-hmm. That's what I would have done if yeah, I were the last guy. I know guy. you didn't. Yeah, you would have. Yeah, except your everyone's name. like, no, that's not what they said. Mm-hmm. That's all right. Shout out. What are we to, gonna do? Um, so what, Ethan? What does she stand to gain from lying? Tell me that. Uh, social clout. Um, yeah. Mm, racist answer. Bang. <laughs> Racist, problematic, yeah. bigoted answer. Oh, Man, you're yeah. dead. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Yeah, no, we, we tacitly acknowledge how much social capital there is to getting people in trouble. Oh, yeah. Oh, hell That's yeah. why people do it. Yeah. yeah and how much camaraderie like, you get for trying Everybody's bonding. like, you get attention. Too. Yeah. They're and brave for positive. doing it. What else would they yeah. stand to gain? like literally everything. We're yeah, the, exactly. yeah, we're in the age yeah. of the tattletale. Literally, yeah, it's tattletale renaissance right mm-hmm. now. It's so, dude, snitching is so awesome. Because now it's like fair game. Let's do it to everybody. I'm it can back. I'm the tattletale now. statue with the tiny penis. It does tattletale feel like uh, <laughs> Seth Simon's kind of like cut, completely cucked. Like if the guy, you really have to like pick your shot. Well, and, he tried and to make sure who you tattletale on yeah. won't come back. He tried strong. to he tried mm. to ball mm. up and guard a big man. You don't yeah. when you're a little man, you don't guard a big That's man. That's true. Yeah, that is that is mm-hmm. Wolfgang. You're right on. And mm-hmm. That's Shane exactly right. hit the post like like much. Shane tried to or Seth tried to post too little. And Shane dunked on him. Yeah. Like, who's too little? He now, just bitch? he just blocked him in the post and just shoved him and all the way into the key, <laughs> past the key, all the way into the paint. Can I Shane hear the story? Who's this fucking home. loser we're owning right so now? It's the guy oh, that uh, the guy got that Shane, Shane in trouble. The guy who found the clip that got. Oh, him. Yeah. so cool. The original oh yeah, and what is he's a, he's a, he's in pedophile jail now, right? What did he, he do? discontinued <laughs> his blog. Uh, well, no, let's start a bunch of fans. I'm saying let's let's start a rumor. No, just some girl. I did that to somebody that said I was stealing a joke online the other day. They were like. This feels familiar. I can't point out where it's from, but I know that I've just heard this before. I was like, yeah, I'm pretty sure you're a pedophile. I've no evidence <laughs> or I you know, that arrest around. records to back that up, but something about you is giving off pedophile vibes. Congratulations. So Tough to break, buddy. Word for it. I have a mutual friend with Seth Simons, and he asked my friend how she could still be friends with me because I associate with Nazis. Yeah. So Who, me and Wolfgang. Yeah, because we're good. <laughs> hang- we're good. Hang. No, Louis yeah. J. Gomez. The no, Nazi. what they don't oh, understand yeah. is that I'm Indian, and that's like a different symbol in my country. Yeah, I'm Polish, and the, quite I'm, frankly, that's the opposite. Hey, I'm half Polish. Afghan. The original Aryans. Oh, that does not my case. Yeah. Yeah. Sorry. Yeah. <laughs> People think that being Jewish is the opposite of being Nazi. No, it's being a Polish. It's yeah, that's true. Because you just got trampled into the mud. Yeah. I thought being a black queen was the opposite of being a Nazi, but I guess Guys, you really can't yeah. do Jolly Ranchers. They could have just. Way. You guys can't eat candy on the show. What are you talking about? Because so it, it like comes through in the mind. What kind of people ableist get, people bullshit get, people is People get this? really mad. Robbie. Get, Robbie. The, our autistic fans are getting so mad. I want to. All right. <laughs> let the uh, all right. Let the record show I said I something. I have a gun. Let me eat candy. All right. All right I won't eat fucking Let candy. them eat candy, Robert. Okay. All right. No, I'm no. not eating fucking candy. Go ahead. Candy. 
Out of respect for your viewers. No, yeah, dude. <laughs> they, get they will get, they will get mad. Shit. I don't do the shit pro bono, dude. Everyone, uh, follow Ethan. Follow me on Instagram, please. Yeah. Please. Edna, Any- follow Ethan, please. Dude, I'm trying to fucking be... I'm trying to get so many followers. And look up his Brooklyn arrest Comedy. record at don't nypd.com. Look Actually, go ahead. I don't think you'll find any. I'm, I, I, I would be surprised. Yeah. If now, anything. let's introduce you to the... Uh, when did you start comedy? <clears throat> what? Oh, good. Uh, November 2021. Wow, that's very... So you're new comedy. I'm relatively new. Oh, wow. Yeah, I am. You yeah. made quite a splash. Yeah. Thank you. Wow. Thanks. I'm surprised to hear that. Yeah. And I appreciate hearing yeah. that. So, uh, what... Did you start in New York? Uh, Yeah. Wow. I grew, I so after I left Emerson in disgrace, <laughs> um, I came. No, this was post COVID. I, I I moved back to Boston. I was going back to Emerson. Uh-huh. Are you uh, from Boston? No, I'm from I'm from Bay Ridge. I'm from Brooklyn. Oh, okay, okay. Um, wow. So I moved you're back. A, you're a fucking city kid. I'm a fucking dude. Yeah. 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 yeah, yeah. Except Bay Ridge is not. Bay Ridge has no cultural identity at all. It's just residential. Or yeah, whatever. it's yeah. just it's very copy, and then mm-hmm. it, it is like pretty like. Syrian Palestinian. Gotcha. Like there's a good, there's gotcha. a good like Arab community. There's a lot of people saying my friend and the uh, yeah my friend yeah. Astaghfirullah yeah. 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 yeah I know a lot of fucking Arab words. Yeah, I have a question Whoa, whose side I'm on. Something weird. If you live around all the cops, the neighborhood's nice. <laughs> What's going on? I don't know. <laughs> Nobody's breaking into my bodega anymore. Shh, <laughs> shh, shh, shh. Wolfgang, I'm begging you to shut up. It's like my Afghan, my Af, my my very Afghan family listen to like the same music at bodegas. I'm like, how do you guys listen? To like, it's like, <laughs> so beautiful, like, such a beautiful song. Is this the same song that's every going time on you for say, like hundreds of hours? You say Afghan, I go blanket dog Afghanistan. Yeah, it's not Afghani. It's Afghani. Yeah. No. Oh, okay. Afghan is a different. You guys are. It's crazy. A- Afghan and Afghani both. Y'all are crazy over there in the East stands. Yeah. But yeah, I started uh, after, kind of mid-COVID, and I was like, I think I will kill myself if I don't try. If, oh, first, I'll kill myself if I don't get a hobby. So you're doing like the roof mics and stuff like that? Um, I started to. I did a couple outdoors, but it was kind of working its way back in. You did mics in college, though. I, I, I did a handful. I did yeah. maybe I did comedy for maybe a month and a half. You know, I was you, in the same sketch. Maybe, really maybe two or three months. I was in the hot. sketch. Same sketch troupe as uh, got too hot. Caleb Pitts, but we never crossed over. You were oh no way you were at CCC yeah was that's at CCC. awesome dude yeah, yeah. dude I got it I I got in and then apparently oh, yeah. the reason I was not allowed to do it was um they they heard some weird shit about me really what yeah, yeah, yeah. no that was it that was the, the, oh the, the the whirlwind of this guy's a piece of shit oh my god they heard, yeah, yeah, yeah. So that must happen pretty they heard early about that you like stand up more than in my, it happened um I think my sophomore year that yeah sucks. and then I tried out and I. I didn't get it. Caleb, who's my friend, yeah. who, who's like one of my only friends at Emerson that time, yeah. was like, you got it, and then these two people had a problem with you. Jesus Christ. And that was like That's really so gratifying and also devastating, because yeah. I was like, these people are so funny. That would really, thing. really uh, like, uh, depress dude, sometimes, me. Sometimes, That's sometimes, why I said fuck it. That's why like, I'm leaving. Sometimes they hit you with the you. tech, dude. You get the technical foul. Mm-hmm. It's I, a technical foul. Right. Yeah, yeah I say, and I say technical because those are the people that like to go, I'm um, technically, he's a... <laughs> He's a verbal abuser. He's a verbal abuser. <laughs> He's a serial Gas verbal lighter. abuser. Gaslighter. Technical um, fouls are kind of like that. Emotional like, manipulator and magician. Um, Sleight of hand mm. pussy getter. Mm-hmm. And that makes Slide, me angry. Sleight of hand. Uh, flag, uh, technical foul, he criticized me. <laughs> Women love pulling mm. technical fouls on your uh, ass. Yep. Red card on Ethan. I couldn't follow him at that open mic. <laughs> 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 and that's sexist. Bang, 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 bang. Nice work, Wolf. He created an environment that wasn't conducive for girl comedy it's to true, thrive. It's true, it's true, it's true. Wolfgang truly is the Larry Bird of sexism. Dude, I, I did and a racism, show. And racism and transphobia. No, but especially sexism. And anti-white. I'm just, I'm a, I hit everywhere. I can hit a shot from anywhere on the court. Mm-hmm. You're such a utility player. Uh, role that's why the role that's why the no, history wait, no. books like no, the opposite of role we'll forget player. about me but the legends you're, 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 you're Steph you're amazing at basketball no I'm Steph the only I, person that can cross me up Steph, you are Steph person, I'm no, sorry uh, he's actually Clay no I'm Steph you're Clay nah because I have better hands. you're Clay I'm mm. a playmaker Clay Parks Clay Parks <laughs> Clay Parks is Clay Parks <laughs> boy you can't ball for All shit alright that's it you're demoted to DeAndre Scott Jordan? is now no DeAndre or wait sorry fuck I'm so racist Draymond you're Draymond um, All right, now you. you that's lose. it. You're Rikishi you're, now. You're fucking Andre Iguodala go, now, dude. dude. <laughs> good, good job. You're Jordan Poole, no. gang, motherfucker. <laughs> no, I'm still Steph because I'm actually light skinned as hell, and forgetting and uh, alienating fellow black people of the community is a light skinned. You make so All physically. Right. Fans, write in. Yeah. Only handwritten letters, though, are accepted. Who is the who's Steph? Who's Steph and who's Clay? No, come on. You know my fan base illiterate as hell. That's fucking. <laughs> and, uh, sounds like a Clay kind of guy to me. Mm, sounds dude. like Clay's fan base. 
No, actually, sounds like Draymond's fan. <laughs> You're Clay, bro. I'm sorry. I like Clay. I like Clay just because he seems nice. Clay is a cool guy, actually. I like Clay. Everyone's like, Ooh. I'll take Clay. Everyone's always like that. They go, Ooh. does yeah. his brother? Does he have a brother that plays for the Dodgers or something like that? No, Seth, Steph has a brother who plays with the Hornets, though. No, no, no. But I thought he had Trace a Thompson. I thought. Oh. I thought Clay Thompson had a brother that was in the MLB. Trace, I'm pretty up. sure Trace Thompson's on the Dodgers. Oh, okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. It, might, uh, it might be. No, that's what I thought. Oh, that makes seen, sense. Yeah, because like his dad's league. like an LA sports guy too. So that yeah. makes sense. That's funny, man. <laughs> wow, that's really crazy. My dad went over oh, to Del Curry's sorry. house before he got diver- uh, divorced. Who? Del Curry, Steph's dad. Really? Yeah, because Steph went to high school uh, down the street from where I live, and my dad was like the big wine guy in town. And before Del and his wife got divorced, oh, yeah, they yeah, bought this North house. Fuck. Brandon and, um, wore Del Curry. He, my dad got. <laughs> yeah, but. <laughs> <laughs> what if I like made this <laughs> dude, 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 I'm not 30. You're 30. Shut up. 30, this is 30 for 30. <laughs> yeah. Uh, yeah. Uh-huh, so, like, uh-huh, uh-huh. I'm like the main character of like the team. Uh-huh, uh-huh, uh-huh. Yo, anyone here like listen to Drake? Because he, like, um, sang a song about me, dude. Dude, it's crazy. (laughs) Like, the ball does not go to the basket unless it touches my Uh, hands once. I'm not balding. (laughs) (laughs) Oh. Let's go, Brandon. Yeah. Hey, guys, watch me be okay, the biggest, trying to defend me, kind of cringe. And, yeah. uh, uh, and I'm going to go up sta- uh, on stage, and I'm not going to do anything that justifies me acting like this off stage. <laughs> watch, watch me scream at Robbie Goodwin because I... I'll tell you later. Okay, cool. <laughs> tell us now. That's awesome. Tell us now. We're already in the mud. Uh, <laughs> one time I I brought up, we used to hang out in LA a little bit, and I, one time I like brought, I asked him about this. Neil Brandon told this story about how like, uh, apparently like Brandon like ate one of his chips when they were in the green room one time, like yeah. before Brandon really hit it off, they were still in DC, but uh, uh, Brandon apparently like ate one of Neil Brandon's chips. No way. And Whoa. Neil Brandon like had a special maybe because he's vegan or whatever. And uh, Neil Brandon goes, don't eat the headliner's chips. And then apparently Brandon started crying. <laughs> <laughs> and I asked about that story, and he got really mad at me for even bringing it up. And he's like, where'd you hear that? Who told you that? Damn. Oh, so Damn, it happened. Dude. It 100% yeah. happened. Yeah. And he got so really, awesome. really mad. He had mad. a Shannon Sharp. He's like, oh, no, oh, no, 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 <laughs> oh, no, no, don't even bring that up. No, no. But I appreciate that. I appreciate you bringing that up. I appreciate that. that. <laughs> oh, no, 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 no. One second. One second. One second. One second. One second. Oh, no, no, Ethan. Oh, no, no. Made off color joke. Oh, no, no. To a girl. Oh, no, uh, he's bad from Emerson. I'm glad Don't you worry. Won. I'll save you, Ethan. Oh, no, no, no. Now, here's the thing about Ethan Shop or Ethan Mead. Ethan Mead, should not, Ethan Mead. he should not have been banned yeah. from Emerson College. Man, I, I, oh, Ethan. I think that he, you, sh- he should have been punished. We all agree with that. But nah, he should not have been banned. I think yeah. that Steven, is. He, he learned his lesson. That's nothing wrong. Just because girls can't take a joke is terrible. That's a bit far for me personally. <laughs> we nice. should have flogged him in the Boston Common, but no more. Well, no more. That's, <laughs> That's good. There's not, yeah, yours is fucking heat. Hey, I like yours. Thanks, man. Yeah. <laughs> what we should have done is made him have a roast battle. He's yeah. the thing about now. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Guys versus Why don't we settle this on the court? Even. Why do we have to talk about it behind each other's backs? The violence. What happened to the game I love? <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> Did you see what he tweeted her? when there's two minutes left in the Super Bowl? He's like, This is what the Super Bowl is all about. <laughs> Under two months left. <laughs> he said, Under two months left. Yeah. <laughs> you idiot. The king of just no actual commentary. I love him just like, so he's, much. He is my favorite. He's like Trump. He just isn't, he's the king of just being good on TV yeah. and saying absolutely nothing. Pretty universally bad takes. Yeah. Occasionally a hero. I get the sense he doesn't I watch. I went to the Super Bowl and I sports. bought a Tinder. Yeah. <laughs> doesn't seem like well, especially boost. during when football's on, especially around the Tinder Super Bowl. Boost. I bought a Tinder boost and I still haven't found iSpice I watched, in my matches. Um, I watched <laughs> and the, I'm uh, at the Super Bowl and I know she's on her phone. I watched this, uh, <laughs> I watched the Phoenix Suns uh, Warriors game last, which was like the night before the Super Bowl and I, it was so obvious even a, had not watched basketball in almost mo- in like months. Yeah, like he was awesome. o- he was obviously like the guy I like the guy who just goes up there, you know when you're on a group project and you're the only guy who didn't know what you're mm-hmm. talking about. He was just like I agree. He was like Steph Curry and KD used to be on the same team. And when I see KD look at Steph, I can't help but think KD thinks. Yeah. I wish he was still on my team. And then he'll could just have said introduce that about any game yes. they ever played against. Yeah. And then he'll just slip in what he was actually doing instead of watching basketball. Like, they should have been on the same team, much like the Arkham trilogy. <laughs> yeah. Splash Brothers are <laughs> world renowned, but they just can't finish because they let girls take over the leadership of the team. Dragon Ball is better than the Dragon Ball Z, and that's a hot take. There is literally yeah. that thing of him looking at the fucking Pokemon, being like. Yeah. Charizard is a very uh, my favorite Pokemon because right here you see he has fire, but then he has talents. He's not as he's a little bit more versatile than Bulbasaur. Mm-hmm. No, that's weirdly yeah, is like true. his new persona is just like like what he'll do on his podcast. He'll just take 
questions from anybody. He just reacts. Yeah, yeah he'll just react to anything. But he's really, he's actually a really good bit. Where yeah. He just everything he he's just very serious about. Like yeah. he's like someone asked like All who would win? P- who would John Mander. who could eat more, mm. Peter or Homer? Well, he, that's, Shane, a that's, and he a goes, he goes, that's a good question. If you look at Shane both, Gillis like, or he goes, are Tim? You, are you kidding me? If you look at both their builds, how can you even say Homer even comes close <laughs> to Peter? Peter looks like he already ate Homer twice. <laughs> <laughs> Is that, so a, viewer, you a viewer me? just messaged in Tim Dillon or Shane Gillis. Now, no, no. Look, no, no, no. Look at Shane's specials. You can watch them and enjoy them. Tim Dillon can't even translate through a medium. Well, I, 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 I was watching Stephen A. on, the, on uh, Howard Stern. And Howard Stern's like, so what do you think about uh, Taylor Swift at the uh, Super Bowl? And uh. Stephen A's like, I love Taylor Swift, Howard. And he's like, why? He's like, yeah. Howard, I took my daughter to see it. And it was the greatest experience of my time. <laughs> <laughs> it's like, the most incredible program. He's so good at just acting like everything yeah. is the Super Bowl. Yeah. Like every single <laughs> question he's ever asked is the Super Bowl to him. He's, a, he's pretty much a, a perpetual good time. Yeah. And then he asked, and then he challenges Shannon Sharp on something. Shannon, if you, you want, can't talk about Toyota Thon until you go to Toyota. The thing is, <laughs> ESPN is all Stephen A's. Uh, like all, everyone on ESPN right now is like Stephen A's brainchild. Yeah, and that's why there's just no substance to anything on there. It's all just shapes and colors and sounds. <laughs> like, I have stopped watching ESPN. It's, it's really aggravating. It's awful. But I don't have a substitute because I can't watch any sports you podcast. Too. I don't want to listen to these fucking geeks. You know, like Bill Simmons. That's not true. Wow, nah, no. it's crazy how Patrick Mahomes is just like Keanu Reeves. You know, like <laughs> <laughs> I don't know who he is. Bill Simmons. I don't, like you don't know him. Bill Simmons is. Bill Simmons, you gotta, I gotta. He's look like up. this dumb. You don't know. He's to a jet. He's like a big. He's like the biggest Star sports Wars podcaster. Oh, the McAfee is not bad. Yeah, I wish there was one guy who would be like Burt uh, Kreischer. Now he's a great sports podcaster. Yep, he seems like yep. it. They he, they made him a custom Tampa Bay creamsicle jersey, and he cried. Really? Yeah, it's a very sweet video. Oh, but you think that this man is a. One time, one time, I went to Tampa Bay. Oh, those True are two hundred dollars. True story. I was on the team. I was on the team. True story. <laughs> uh, uh, I, uh, uh, I played for the Buccaneers. Him and That's so weird. what brought that up was because him and Ta- uh, Tom Segura this yeah. weekend were in Vegas for the Super Bowl. And they like crashed Christ. Pat McAfee's show twice, <laughs> and obviously everyone involved just were like, "Okay, Bert, like please don't like." It was it was so. It's go YouTube it. Everyone at home, YouTube it. You guys are both YouTube it. It's. So like it's 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 like just the most cringe. It's a very it's one of those great we don't get these anymore. Incredibly cringe live TV kind of moments. You know what I mean? Everyone there is just so obviously pissed off. Bert's not being funny. The athlete, yeah. the athlete there doesn't know who they are. <laughs> like so he's like, who are they? I don't? What, are they run into him on the street? What, are they, what how do they how do they find him? He was up all night drinking, and they're trying to promote their new vodka. So he just walks on. and He's like, hey Pat. I'm the machine. I'm, I have three movies about me. Is that crazy? Like oh, takes yeah. off his shirt. Yeah, and Pat's machine. like, okay, cool, cool, man, cool, Bert, awesome. Well, <laughs> <laughs> I really wanted to hear more about that, but I. No, it's okay. I was over. Unfortunately, extremely broke. Wolfgang's. <laughs> I also have to pee real quick. <laughs> All right, pee, oh, dude, H Money's gonna kill me. I thought a he- I thought that was like a headphone jack. I saw it fall out. Yeah, I was really like, hoping it was. Like, Oh wow! Well, we can take a we can take a break and then you know do, I don't know. We should maybe go a little bit over. So if Scott has to cut anything, I don't think he will. Even if we ask him though, but okay, I'll pee and come back. Yeah, I have a real back. tendency to break the shit that I like to play with. Hey man. <laughs> oh man, that's Hannah's gun that I broke. Yeah. When are you two gonna figure it out? I think we got it figured out. Sure. Yeah. yeah. As long as I have a gun in my hand, she listens. <laughs> Yeah, that's the Robbie gun. That's the Robbie gun. I just don't worry. I fucking it. shattered it. Holy shit! That does that. Yeah. Fuck yeah. That's why. That's the Wolfgang gun. It's so cool. Thanks, man. Yeah. Oh, yeah. No, no who you're cares? Good. No, completely. Who cares? Right, let, me, let me see that. Let me see if I can try to fix that. Yeah. So Wolfgang, what are some other comics that you hate? Um. <laughs> Not you. It's you. Okay. Um, no, I don't know. People keep telling me I'm a really good comedian, and it, it, um, it's um, I don't, I don't believe that. Uh, and I know that sounds like something a really good comedian, <laughs> someone who thinks they're a really good comedian would say. Yeah. But I'm just like, oh, wow, I'm really flattered. I'm playing shy and coy. Um, yeah. Yeah, dude, what the hell did you do to this? No, I, bro- I broke it is what I did. So, yeah, so that part, that can't come out. Oh, I see. Ah, I see. I see. You, you're uh, retarded. <laughs> dude, it's okay. I'll interview you now. When did you start comedy, Wolfgang? I was 16. It was the biggest mistake of my life. Was that, did you think maybe, oh, maybe I'm... Dude, literally, <laughs> I you do funny at an open mic once, and then just, you don't realize till like, ten years later. 
<laughs> you're like, oh, I could have been a lawyer probably. Do you go on adventures still though? Like, do you go out and you? Um, no, I don't have. Money have you to had a, a brilliant rush of adrenaline or something to set you free? Um, When's the last time you felt free? I do not know. Not lately. Maybe like when I was down in the, the uh, Caribbean and I was just on an island. Yeah, and the ocean is your. But even then, you're limited. You're trapped, but it's like a. It's a way that you're trapped that uh, <laughs> is actually liberating. You are trapped, yeah, because you can't just take the boat and go for miles and show up somewhere. You gotta have a passport. Because Robbie, when's the last time the you walls no longer become What's a prison? That? They become a fortification from the life that you left behind. You know. What'd you ask? When's the last time you felt free? Anyways, Jesus I fixed Christ. the gun. Yeah, conversation got really deep. I don't think I've left. ever felt free, honestly. I can't remember the last time. I'm, I'm so I run so anxious that I think I've always been. Did you get Chipotle? I thought that was Taco Bell. Uh, yeah, yeah, another White Claw. Oh, Fucking dude, beast mode. Beast nice mode. Man. Five thousand. <sighs> That'd be funny if I just pulled out Chipotle with five minutes left in the first episode. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, guys, this can't wait. We're doing the Patreon afterwards. Yeah, I'm so yeah, excited to do excited. that. Yeah, yeah I'll just tell that my my. And if it's better, that'll be the regular episode. This has yeah. been great. What are you talking about? I don't know. I think. Um, what it was too much, too chaotic. No, we, we are. We just got like. Uh, we're, we're both all strong offensive players, you know. Right. Mm. You know, we gotta, we gotta, we gotta hit a flow. We're all kind of right. uh, moving like the, the ball up and down the court instead of you know, playing for ourselves. Would you shut up, man? No. You were crying. You were just bitching and moaning. <laughs> <laughs> fucking. Uh, you were the guy aces. holding the prank. Uh, the fucking the prank. The prank. Kids prank holding the prank. Guy. Shut up. Scott is no, kind of like the point guard up. of our show. How about though? that? I will say that. Can he yeah. hear us? No, Scott? Scott's, Scott's in Ohio, here. stupid. Who the fuck is that? That's, that's, that's Derek. Rob and Derek. That's Rob? Oh, Rob is out there? I can't see him from yeah, this. Rob's, yeah, Rob's not Rob's fucking working. Listening. Yeah. I was yeah, watching dude. TV. Yeah, Ethan, why don't you fucking learn names of people and respect <laughs> the people rough. that... You just walk into people's homes. You're like, who are you, the fucking guy that lives here? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, how about you shut up I think you're fucking, fucking better than me? Yeah, I'm going to drink yeah. this milk out the fucking car. Thanks. Yeah, where's yeah, your dude. toilet? Yeah, dude. You, you're, you're teetering in rowy territory now. I'm not rowy. I did actually just kind of realize that I'm like, oh, my actions have consequences. <laughs> that yeah. Really, yeah, that really do. pissed me off. That does yeah. suck when you realize that. I fucking that. hate it, dude. Yeah, I hate when my actions have consequences. Hey, shut up. Okay. Yep, see? Uh, doesn't feel so good, does it? <laughs> <laughs> I don't mean it. Oh, man, I wish I had Mike's heart mm-hmm. instead. It's not about what you mean, dude. It's the opposite Do you like Mike's heart? Do you really like Mike's heart? I fucking I've never met anything I've in front met, of our best I friends. I've literally never met a single person in my it's life you guys. who said they liked Mike's heart. Dude, lemonade. my first... My first complete drink of my life was a tall boy Mike's Harder tangerine. Ooh. No, excuse me, blood orange. It's like eight percent alcohol, and the girl was like, "I'll make out with you if you finish this." Mm-hmm. And I never, I never had a full of course drink. She for wanted to make out with you. Yeah, exactly. But I was like, I fucking awesome. throated that. And then you're shit. like, oh, this is why your arms are you fat and you wear denim jackets. She was skinny. She was a college athlete. She played soccer from IT. I bet she wears a denim jacket now. <laughs> what, who was it? Leah Thomas. <laughs> Trans, uh, <laughs> trans uh, oh, dude. Uh, and if I did, yeah. I think he's gay. If I knew anything about sports, I would have really kind of gave huh? what that deserved in the moment. It was. Well, I I don't know anything about women swimming, but I was like, remember that right wing thing when they were like, yeah, it was like the I don't know, whatever. I remember I like, that right wing. I just wing wanted to call Ethan they gay. Were, uh, they Everyone's were, first argument against yeah. uh, transitioning. Well, what about college sports? Won't that just right. ruin? Yeah, right. I'm sorry. So what about no? no I, I mean, that's a good point. Thought, yeah. That's a good no, point. That's a really good point. No, yeah. no, not you making fun of them. They're actually that is the most important. Thing. But you know what? Like, is what it? about that thing that yeah. keeps me from oh. doing domestic terrorism? <laughs> exactly. I get to watch it every Saturday. It's the balance of. Members but it, of the but they don't watch women's college sports. Well, no, because they always trying, watch men's college yeah, sports. Right. To be entertained. Well, what about I care about this now? Yeah. Huh? This is the first time my life I've ever. But what if I pretended to give a fuck? How would you feel? Yeah. What if for the first time I feel enthusiasm and zeal about a thing in 30 years? <laughs> yeah. What if I, like, this breathes new life into me? Yeah. Gives me but you purpose. know why they do it, though? Because liberals won't be honest and be like, yeah, that's stupid. They'll just be like, what? Well, you know, they, they, they know it's a <laughs> well, gotcha. Yeah, no, it's that's like, why they bring it it's up. Uh, they're being obstinate. Yeah. They want, they want but like. they don't care. They don't care about fucking women's call. No, they don't care. What I'm saying Have is. Have you watched they, women's like, college sports? They just want to be like, they want they want the vindication of somebody <laughs> that they Shichari, disagree with being Shichari, like, you know what? You made a good point. Shachari or Shikari. Oh, Rose. that. Yeah, yeah. Rosario yeah, Dawson. Cool. The girl yeah. who smoked weed and then got in trouble for smoking weed. And she's like, well, you can't smoke weed? Yeah. And they're like, no. She's like, fucking really? Hell yeah, dude. Was that Brittany Griner? She's kind of awesome. 
Yeah, Brittany, Brittany Griner also they did it. Be, these bitches begin trying No, but I like it weed. when people that smoke weed get punished for it. It's like, yeah, fucking grow up. It's yeah. illegal. Stop smoking weed. It's a drug. Yeah, just yeah. stop. It's a hard drug. Whoa. Why yeah, you, it's a, it ruins lives. It's not even that. It's, just, it's a gateway it, drug. It's just that you, you're annoying when gateway you're on to it. All, my all dumbest you do is friends. talk gateway about it. Gateway to Doritos. Yeah. Why don't you fucking grow up? <laughs> And fucking start a Roth IRA. <laughs> that was a joke from like that? 1995. That's a good joke. Yeah, yeah. it's a gateway drug. It's a gateway drug. Yeah, it's gateway, gateway to gateway to the Seven <laughs> Eleven where I will freaking buy Doritos and Skittles and other snacks and such. Gateway wow, to bro, the, yeah. that was f- freaking epic. Okay, wait a minute. I didn't wait realize. Wait a minute. Did, did he just reference the Simpsons on a podcast? Oh, is it a Simpsons joke that I just kind of ripped off? Uh, no, 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 no. I thought you were doing comic book guy voice. Ooh, that's way too freaking good. No. What was it? Yeah. Eat, bung, oh, hit, guy. transplant. <laughs> okay, everybody. Uh, <laughs> oh, is that Ta- atomic book guy. Uh, yeah. What was it? A bung, hit, transplant. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. You're freaking giving me the ick right now. All right. Uh, okay. All right. That does it for the free episode. Or maybe it was just a Patreon. We'll see. We'll uh, see. Anything, anything maybe plug? it's a bonus. Sophomore Slump Comedy. Flophouse Comedy Club. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Wednesday, yeah. February 28th. Grant I, gave me a spot on that. Your Wolfgang has a spot on that. Mm-hmm. Robbie gets nothing. God damn it. I can never, I never we'll get, get spots. You. Thanks, man. We'll get you. That'd I like sick. you. Oh, thanks, man. Uh, I just need a sh- I need to I need to start a show so I can start giving people things back. Exactly. Yeah. Uh, Wolfgang, anything? Mm, no, not really. My life is empty and purposeless. <laughs> Are you all right? Are you depressed today? No, I have a gun in my hand. Why would I be depressed? You're right. Okay. Well, thank you, everybody. Uh, once again, what of my silly hat? Why Patreon, Twitter, Wee! Instagram. Wee! I'm trying to be more professional and remember to plug these things so we grow. Yeah. Listen, guys. Yeah, follow me for me forever on TikTok. Maybe Warheads, we did this for you. We did this for you. Warheads. Do you think I want to be here? I think Derek just came in here to steal the gun back. <laughs>